Hi, good morning. This is Dr. Lee Lacer with Natural Transplants. Today we have V here, who's driven all the way up from North Carolina, right? Mm -hmm. So she's coming in here with some traction alopecia. Uh, we have a little bit of hair loss along the frontal regions and some along the sides that extends a little behind her ears here. So, so what brought you to us, V? Um, like you said, traction alopecia, um, tight hairstyles, over-processing as far as chemicals. Um, and I'm 38, and it's, I want to say I've noticed this since I was 16. Wow. Right. So to be able to have an option to even, you know, make it different, it's, yeah, definitely a great thing. Well, thank you for doing a video yes. for us, getting the word out to other people, yes. knowing that there is an option to, yes. to treat the hair loss yes. here. And don't be afraid or ashamed, because it's going on with a lot of females. They're just not putting it out there. So that's why I wanted to do this video. Definitely, yeah. definitely. So we'll get to work on some drawings and then we'll touch base with you guys uh, a little later. Hi, it's Dr. Lee Lacer again with Natural Transplants and we have V. So we drew out the areas of hair loss here. So uh, she has about a finger breadth loss up in her frontal region. And about a two finger breadth loss on, uh, on her sides. So you can see the area that we're going to work in. She does have a smaller head, but her density is going to make it a little tough for us to get all the way back into this area here. Uh, and something similar on the on the right hand side, but uh, we do have a lot of tissue marked out to, to make the grafts. Are you excited, me? I'm very excited. I'm very <laughs> excited. Yes. Well, it's going to be an awesome day. All right. We're going to have a lot of fun and we will check in with you guys a little later. Hey, it's Dr. Lee Lacer with Natural Transplants. So we have V, we just got done with a nice full day. We packed in her frontal area, redid her edges all around and uh, packed in the sides here. And um, she's got a beautiful tiny little scar here. Let me turn her around so you can see. See, the incision site is really nice and tight and tiny. Looks a little dramatic now that it's uh, somewhat swollen and pretty fresh. But loving the way that we packed these things in. We were able to go further back than I expected, uh, given the amount of hair loss that she had and uh, how much it uh, impinged on the donor area. But we covered quite a bit. So how do you feel, V? I can't even put it in words. <laughs> like, <laughs> you know, I don't even have my results yet. But just the fact that I went through with this and I know what can come after this, um, I'm very very excited and thankful for sure. Yeah, so it'll be yep. four months before we see any hair grown out of those grafts, nine right. months for it to start thickening up, and 12 months on average is when you should see the final product in terms of the density. Gotcha. But I'm loving the way that this got packed in there and excited for how things are gonna look. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Call us now, 844-327-4247, and ask about our Hue and Hue Plus procedures, which move more hair than ever before. Hope to hear from you soon.